Well, good afternoon, Hunter Chilla. Oh, I'm so glad that Hunter joined me one more again for zooming in on sustainability. This year, the Queen Quet Head Pun Body, the Gullah Geechee Nation. So glad that we did pun. We in episode of this year already. Great God, this is a blessed thing though, because you know. This is the 20th anniversary of the Gullah Geechee Nation and thing like that. So we're so glad that we had this new program for bring to all the hunter children out, Jonah, and say thank you, thank you to all the hunter who view them. After we done finish them live, you go on to the Gullah Geechee.tv and tune in for we. And we so thank you, thank you to all the hunter children who are sending all the comment and thing about how much hunter the Yeti, how much hunter to learn, and how much you want to help we with we sustainability. Hashtag Gullah Geechee 2020. So, you know, we can't just have program dry long so and thing like that. It. We ain't just to try for sustain this beautiful land and the water and thing where you see I just sit on now. We also to try for sustain we body. We have a sustain we body and thing like that. It. So it can make a difference where you do to them, how long you hold up. It just like with your car. You have to take care of them if you want them to run a while, any. Okay, then. I know some of y'all say, girl, stop. Soon as you pee, I'm off. That thing broke down. Well, let we don't broke down. That's the point of what we to do this your day. So before we go on and bring on we guest today, I want to do what we always do. Let we take a moment of silence for the people who don't cross over into the realm of the ancestors all this year air. Some done going in because of Rona and things like that. But other rest of the people just going on and cross over. In all case, all of this year must have been their time. But we just pray right now that his soul arrests peacefully and that we done Yeti from them all we could have Yeti, but we be better people on this year earth in the future. So let me take a moment of silence. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Now, I'm chilling, plenty of hundred children that type to me and thing like that and say, oh, great God, queen, queen, life for Yeti, hundred to crack your teeth and thing like that. The life for Yeti, all of them go like thing. We won't do that. We won't be like that. We won't do this shit and thing like that. Look here, this thing ain't a dry long soap. This thing, I think of the spirit. And hundred have to be naturally gonna get you. So this is a thing you live. This ain't a thing you learn. You understand? This is a thing you live. This ain't a thing you learn. So you can't throw a class at you and you get them like this shit. The thing come to you naturally. So that way I brought my guest here today. This your gal root stem from John's Island, just like the last week. Y'all yeti from Ketnu, it root come from John's Island too. They must have rooted down John's Island. They'll grow up all these gal, yeah. Whoa, oh, doing this healing thing, you know. But it root come from John's Island and then shock down. Okay, how we could do this year? That way it going, going north. It going north, chuck down. Great, that gal to cover that whole county, yeah. And we thank you, thank you to Charleston County, thank you, thank you to the city for celebrating one more again, Gullah Geechee Nation Appreciation Week. Thank you, thank you to that. We just see Bluffton Sandy in their proclamation just now for the show. Come on, thank you, thank you, Bluffton, thank you, thank you, City of Beaufort. We get on a young their city too, and thing like that. Because they all are celebrate with we who we be for Gullah Geechee 2020. But now, in cave in 2020 or whenever we know we be gonna get you a 90 people and you do that thing naturally so look who we got ya a lafia olubusala a banner of naturally geechee how honor to do today i'm good i'm good a lafia how you doing queen I will, I will, gal. It's so good for see you on anything I got at it. Since we're on up in a run, run, I ain't get for see you. We've been a grind place every couple of weeks for Rona. I know, I know. Rona, pull the switch out and say, stay your Hold down. <laughs> <laughs> and he says, stay on. But, mm -hmm. but I look at, but you ain't slow down. I ain't slow down. Because people still order things. People still yes, contact me. Because this must be a truly blessed up time for Naturally Geechee. Because I know a lot of people who weren't using natural products started using them because yes, they are concerned now about their health. Mm -hmm. But tell us, what made you start out creating the products? You could have just as soon just hunted for products and bought them from people too. Why did you start and when did you start? Okay, so I, okay, I started, I'm going to say I started making the products about seven years ago. Wow. And I started because I was on a healing journey. 
So mm -hmm. as you know, or some of the guests know, you know, I was born with medical conditions that kept me hospitalized a lot, you know, mm -hmm. and I didn't know what to do just from being sick all the time. Mm -hmm. And so I started just a holistic approach to my healing, just eating better. And mm -hmm. that's what pretty much launched everything. I started eating better. I started healing myself. I started, you know, really paying attention to product labels, not only food product labels, but product labels that I use every day because we use products every day and we put it on our skin. And if we're talking about eating better, you're putting products on your skin, you're digesting those products as well. So yeah. now I have to pay attention to that. And so when I did that, I was like, well, I can't buy products out of the store because every single product I see, you say you have good ingredients, but then you also have all of these extra ingredients that yeah. I'm not looking forward to put on my skin. And words that we can't even pronounce. I can't even pronounce it. I don't even yeah. know what it is. And it has nothing to do with whether we speak gull or not. <laughs> you can't pronounce it. It's sometimes no one can pronounce the word. Pronounce. Right. <laughs> and it's just like, okay, so let me just research myself and let me find out what's already what did our creator already create for us? Yes, yes. And, and, we, and you know, and when you say create for us, create for us naturally. Has naturally. it right there in the environment. Yes. Things that, like you said before, and you and I talked about this just a few minutes ago, your skin is an organ. Mm -hmm. It also is an organ. Like I said, people, you know, say their skin, like they don't realize your skin is your body. It <laughs> you is, know, it it is, is a living and breathing organism. It's breathing, it's breathing in everything. Everything you put on it is getting into your bloodstream. So it's just yeah. like any other organ. Absolutely. And so we have to be concerned about that. So that's why I know you're part of the Gullah Geechee Sustainability Think Tank so that we can literally breathe in and breathe out positivity and healing. We yes. want to protect our waterways. We want to protect our land because as you mentioned, we are ingesting all these things. So why would we fight so hard to protect the water that's outside of us, not protect the water inside of us, exactly. protect the air outside of us and not protect that skin that's breathing in things. Mm -hmm. So now, so seven years ago, you started just on a personal journey. Just on a personal journey. Yeah, a lot of people do that. But then mm -hmm. why expand it? Why share what you learned with others? Some people would have just said, well, I was trying to heal me. So I got me, I good. You know, and they would stop. I mean, right. why go ahead and bring it out into an actual product line? I did the product line because just making, I only started making the whipped shea butter at first. Mm -hmm. And um, I let people try it just as, oh, try this. I have made this and they loved it. And I was like, Hmm. I wonder if I package this cream up and make it look presentable, if people would buy it, if I find out a way to sell it or a, a place to sell it. Right, right. And then and I saw you were selling it all over the place. I was <laughs> selling it all over the place. I started in Charleston at the Latin Flea Market. Yes. I started there and it just grew from there and people started Sometimes, you know, people, some people don't want to get it. And then some people buying it. And then it's just, it's just patience, pretty much what it is. And me staying diligent to what I wanted to do. I wanted to share my healing journey with everybody. I wanted to let them know that there is a, another way to heal your body, your skin, your soul, your spirit is another way than all of these medical and all of these unnatural methods there's other ways of healing you can use what the creator has already put here on the earth and you can heal your body and i just wanted to share my journey with everybody because where i came from to where i'm at now is for me it's incredible wonderful and yeah, I've watched healing the skin yeah. and just i went back you know i went back to school got a degree because i wanted to really know how to mix the products properly so yeah. that when I, because I'm using them first. Right. And absolutely. I need quality products on my skin. So right. everybody else gets quality products. And, and so that's sure pretty do. much, that's yeah. how it started. It started from the Latin flea market. And from there, like you said, I went everywhere to MUSC at the hospital, different events yeah. in town, going to different state cities, meeting with you. I met you through the products. Yes, so. definitely. Yeah. And it's been a blessing. And see, if y'all think she's storytelling, let me show y'all something right now. 
This is now a collector's item. See why I got richer? See why I got richer, Venom? See, you, you say, put that down, queen. Put that down, because they ain't how you look now. Put them down. But I want right. people to know, this is my original jaw. Yeah. Right. A naturally Geechee products, right, y'all? I remember when we talked about the label. And mm -hmm. working on the labels. I remember that. And now I got my own personal first jaw. For the, for the new packaging, right, jump. See, mm -hmm. and so so now you have went from a brand establishing a brand to a rebrand. But right. let me make you laugh about this journey between you and me now. Now, as you know, it's my twentieth anniversary as the queen. I had fun the body to go. Mm -hmm. So the media now is coming to me and contacting me and I'm kind of like giving them the side eye because I don't want to do too much of in face interviews and things like that. I like, no, I ain't want to see nobody now. Y'all do a print story, do a print story. But you know, TV ain't going to do no print story. So here it is. They came. I thought one person was going to show up to interview me and she showed up with an entire crew, cam, still camera, video wow. camera audio the whole i'm like oh no and so everybody's all masked up i'm like oh y'all stay over there stay back stay back right and so i'll take my mask off y'all stay away right so i said oh so we're gonna do this now i need to touch up my lipstick so the host the anchor says oh yeah because you don't want your makeup to run in this weather i said makeup i said no the only makeup i wear is lipstick she went oh so, oh, you just naturally beautiful like that. Your skin is just that beautiful. I ain't respond. I just pulled my lipstick out and went on. <laughs> and so, and I said, I couldn't wait to tell you because the only other thing I had on was my naturally Geechee. That's right. That was all. My naturally Geechee is on the rest of my skin. And the only other thing, just because you ain't selling it yet, but my girl Jerry sell lipsticks. So yes, she is. We're going to leave that with Jerry. <laughs> exactly. So I went on Vixen Cosmetics the other day. She just ain't got the, the all the tones I want just yet. But as soon as okay. she gets the other tones, I'm getting some from her at Vixen Cosmetics. And so definitely everything here is naturally Geechee for truth. I naturally go to Geechee. And when I naturally go to Geechee, as soon as you came on the day, I was like, oh, look at her. She's glowing. She's beautiful. Then I said, oh, she must be wearing my products. Uh huh. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it has been a wonderful journey with you. I know that you mentioned all these places you've gone, but I know one of the things that's a blessing is that I've seen you evolve and grow as you're able to talk more to people about the healing process mm -hmm. and about your line of products because you've been a part of our Gullah Geechee Nation International Music and Movement Festival every year. And you're going to be part of our telethon on July 25th. Yep, yep. I'm telling yep. y'all can watch them right here, gullahgeechee.tv. And y'all can also go to a growing culture at noon on Saturday, July 25th on the Gullah Geechee Nation Facebook fan page. We're going to be having hashtag Gullah Geechee 2020 virtually because we want to keep the family safe and keep the family healthy. That's the whole point. So we're going to do everything live on video, tape it, and then run it back. The same way they do BET. All right. So we're going to run it. That whole week, that's Gullah Geechee Nation Appreciation Week. Mm -hmm. And I've appreciated your growth and Naturally Geechee's participation and sponsorship and support of the festival for all these years since we met. But tell me, in that course of time, you've had, like you said, start off with just a whipped shea butter. And then you had the different flavors. Right, the right. Butter, right. <laughs> and then when you rebranded, you took away some of our flavors. I did. I did. I did. So what we did when we, when we did the rebranding, we figured that, cause I had all together 15 different scents of wow. the shea butter. And wow. you know, um, because you know, I am a small business. I am the only person that's making these products. Yes. So a lot right goes in into, right, right, right here in the Gullah Geechee Nation. Right here in the Gullah Geechee Nation. And so it takes a lot. So we were thinking, let's kind of hone it in and just maybe do five of the most popular scents because you kind of already had the 15 out there. So you kind of know which ones were selling the best. Mm -hmm. However, during this rebranding time, I've realized that through my customers that, that it's just not enough. All 15 were, fav were the favorites. Oh, Everybody wow. likes all of them. They're missing the other scents. Right. So I'm actually bringing those back. Excellent. 
very, very soon with, um, with another package, another jar. It's a new jar. Um, it's also a glass jar. So it's actual, you know, sustainable material. We're still yeah. sticking with that. So um, I can kind of show a, a little preview for those who yeah. are going to tune in. Yeah. So this is um, the, the jars that nice. I currently have. And then I'll be adding these jars. That's pretty. I like that. Yeah, and I'm adding those just to bring the other scents back um, because, like you said, um, I know people miss the scents, and I know some of the scents you actually like some of the scents as well. So yes. it's not only you; it's everybody, and it's, everybody. It's, it's been going on for some ever since I did the rebranding, and people are messaging me. So you don't have pina colada anymore? What happened to mango madness? That was my favorite. Mango madness, was, the best one, mango madness. I know, <laughs> and then also the one with the um the grass. What's the right name for it? Sunkiss. Sunkiss. Yes. Sun I got. I still have Sunkiss. Okay. I still yeah. have Sunkiss. Mm -hmm. Well, put my order in now for that large. Okay. Office. Yes. So that's wonderful. Now, one of the things, though, I know that just like we talked about product labeling and how mm -hmm. you branded your products and you mm -hmm. have them in in new casing, one might say. Mm -hmm. A concern is always now about allergies because different people have food allergies and because you have natural products some of us that have food allergies we can't use certain kinds of oils or mm -hmm. certain types of things you know people have nut allergies or avocado allergy different things like that so with your products i know you have the things we rub on our skin mm -hmm. but don't you also have some hair care products as well and things for the lips because with all this mask wearing i know that my lips suddenly start getting dry now my lips right. never used to get dry but mm -hmm. now they get like dry and i have to go ahead and and go in my jaw and do this because i've already used up my lip balm so add that to my list too i need three more of those so okay. i know you have the lip balm i know you have some hair care products tell the audience what all do you have and how do you deal with the same thing does your customers just have to do the same thing can they go to their website and when they're on the website do they see what's in it so that they don't have to concern themselves with potentially getting something that is natural but they naturally have an allergy to it okay so i'll first i'll start off by saying telling you all the products that i have and i'll show you some of them so i have the um the hair and body oil Beautiful. So it does, it has the avocado oil and, um, and sweet almond oil. And then it either, either has lemongrass and um, rosemary or lavender and sage. Yeah. I also make shampoo, black soap shampoos, all natural shampoo. Um, the oh, lip balm. Shampoo. I, I use that a lot. Yep. I got the, yeah. um, the lip balms. Yep. Love the lip balm. As well. And then we also have body scrubs. Oh, see, I don't um, think I This is an oatmeal body, body scrub. And I also carry a coffee body scrub. Okay. And when you I go online, oatmeal. get me an oatmeal, oatmeal in my product order because I like oatmeal body scrubs. I love oatmeal anything. I love eating nampon oatmeal and all that kind of thing. So yes. I, I let my skin eat them too. Mm -hmm. And so the oatmeal body scrub has oatmeal and dry chamomile leaves in it. Ooh, so that's, it's, that's... Yeah, it's really good. It, it's great to exfoliate your skin. We, we need to exfoliate our skin to remove the dead skin cells and then it, you know, bring reveals that nice clean fresh skin underneath so yeah. that's why you exfoliate but if you go on the website it does tell you the ingredients that's in all of the products if you are if you do have food allergies um or anything like that what you can do is on the website you're able to actually send me personal messages that i get immediately and i can reply anywhere i'm at remotely from my laptop or from my phone okay. we can chat while you're online and if you're allergic to avocados, what you can do is let me know. What I can do is make you a special blend of the product for you and I can send you a separate invoice. You wouldn't order off of the website. I would send you an invoice off of the website without the ingredient that you're allergic to. So I can, because I make it myself, I can make, make yours to order. Yeah, custom order. Yeah, right. Custom right. Order. It may be a little more. I was going to ask just, that. Mm -hmm. Just because it's outside of, I'm making it uh, something separate That's from a batch. big old batch that I can, exactly. yeah. So it's just a, a small fee for the um, order, but I do make adjustments to any of the products um, if you're allergic to anything. And that's just the beauty of making your own products. Like I can mm -hmm. add things and take them out. Right. And then that's Couture. It's really a custom made product. Right. 
you. Mm -hmm. And so definitely I'll be, I'll be sending you a little messaging myself because I know right now you can't write down all of what I'm throwing in my cart <laughs> as we talk it, but I'll definitely message you and let you know all the things I want, including the custom order. Cause like I said, I need some yes. more oils for my hair because yes. also it's so hot right now, you know, that your hair dries out, it your does. skin dries out. And we're talking about drinking a lot of water, mm -hmm. because, you know, in this whole pandemic, we need to stay hydrated. But anyway, in the Sea Islands every year, we always encourage hydration. Because people don't realize that even though you may not be sweating at that moment or feel thirsty at that moment, at the, by the time you feel thirsty, it's too late. It's too late. Yeah. So you need to be hydrated all the time. And so hydration is not only just pouring stuff down your throat, but also your skin. Keeping and you got to make sure you are hydrated and don't think that you're just going to use great products and you're not putting great things inside of your body, like the food yeah. you're eating and good water, because the products that you're using is not going to work. Because I've heard many, many people say their hair is dry or, and they are using these products and they keep ordering these natural products, but their hair or their skin is always dry. And I'm like, mm, so what do you eat? What do you eat? Right. Are you are you are you hydrated? Is your body hydrated? Because your cells need to be hydrated from the inside out. That's right. That's right. So it's a holistic approach. It's a holistic approach. Yes. So you have to eat well. You have to sleep well. Mm -hmm. You have to be in a healthy environment, and yep. the healthiest environment has to be the body. So right. you have to, like you said, it works from the inside out. What defiles you comes from inside, not from exactly. outside. All right. And so we have to recognize that. And that that's scriptural, <laughs> you know, uh, that's ancient now. Mm -hmm. And so definitely we've been talking about these products and people have been hearing you talk about the card and how to reach you and they can text you. Well, give out your website and aren't you also on other platforms on social media? So I am. find Naturally Geechee. Yes, you can find me at is www.naturallygeechee.com. And I hope you all know how to spell naturally. And Geechee is G E E C H E E. That's right. Ain't no no uh -huh. Geechee for the week. Why no. on? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So in Naturally Geechee, you can also find me at Naturally Geechee on Instagram and Naturally Geechee on Facebook. I'm also on Twitter. I don't post on Twitter a lot, but I'm still on there. Um, and I'm also on Snapchat because, I mean, hey, I need to be on all forms of social media so that you can know that Naturally Geechee is here and thriving. Um, I want you all to keep checking all my social media and when you go on the website, please subscribe to the website because once we add the new scents and everything, I am going to be doing prom promotional deals and everything and giving you coupons or whatever. You can go online and use your little coupons to get a little, save a little bit with Naturally Geechee. So um, we do that as well. And we um, do little promotional things from the from social media. So check my story and my post and stuff like that. And we'll, and I'll put little promotional things or little codes that you can use to get a little discount on the website. That is wonderful. So now I wonder if I should hold back my order. No, I'll, gonna... I'll send you a promotional I, code, Queen. I, I'll send you I, your, I'll send you your own personal promotional code. code. See, that's what's up. That's what's up. See, being the queen has its purpose. You know, yes. Naturally, Gucci. So yes, definitely. It's a wonderful thing. So now I know that you also come from an agrarian family. You yes. come from a family that lives from the land and farms and you still doing what you can to hold on to the land. How yes. thing the going with the farm on John Tyler this year? Yeah, what's going on? Things are going good. I feel like um, this year, you know, um, when I went out there and talking to my dad right now, like last weekend I went out there and I helped, helped him plant some seeds. We planted kale seeds and um, cabbage seeds. Nice. And um, I saw some collard green seeds and I'm really now just seeing these seeds. They look so weird. Like they don't look like they don't look, they don't look like, like, like they're growing to what they would become, right? No, no, they don't. But right. um, this year, I think that just like you said, like um, people are using my products more. People are actually eating more natural now. They're eating more of the produce now, the local produce. So he had a really good year. I think he he underestimated how his sales would be. And I don't think he planted enough this year as oh. he wanted to. And then the rain kind of messed up some of the crops because we, you know, well, rain is very needed, but yeah. um, too but much rain yeah, yeah. yeah. will Rocks actually kill the crops. crops. Those, yeah. and I think I actually told you told you about the deers and stuff like that coming to eat yes, the crops. So. The deer been a nam on everything that everybody behind. That's why some hunter chilling will follow the queen. Y'all see, I got one fence now. 
I got one fence on my thing. Yay. I love Bambi. I love Bambi, but Bambi, I'm to try for feed on her and your family. Yeah. Okay. Everybody uh, fencing up. Everybody fencing up around the um, crops and stuff because them deers is relentless. And it's because, yeah. you know, my dad told me it was because, you know, um, they coming down on people hunting out of season. And um, so that's why these deers, is, they just out there. They just reproducing right. and they just out here because they being so strict on people with hunting the deers now. So. Absolutely. The deer just need a shirt and say, we out you. And that's what the deer. Pretty deer much because they out you. Yeah, they out you, any. Okay, but I know the hunting club is ready. It's plenty <laughs> of Gullah Geechee hunters, and they're just a tick down the time because August 1st, the hunting season. Oh, and that's when it starts. Ready. Yes, ma'am. So they're done ready. So yesterday, okay. I've been to leave the library in the dark. I done post up something at the library. I go there because the internet faster than mine. So right. I go beyond and post up, and I see a bunny. There's a cute bunny that I oh. love to see. And I said, oh, they got my bunny friend. Okay, the bunny. <laughs> right. bunny friend. Well, when I've been leaving, when I've been going in, I see the bunny. When I've been leaving, I'm looking for the bunny. Yeah, one big old buck walk across the road. I said, wow, I ain't going <laughs> to see you. <laughs> he done and kicked he the bunny. <laughs> oh, he done kicked the bunny. He done gone. So I said, no, but the bunny be going one way. He be going the other way. So I said, oh, y'all across the road this time mm -hmm. of night. But they, I guess they figure in the dark, ain't none of these, these people out at this time of evening. I gone on. I walk. Right. And then here I come. So that was really a blessing to see him. I don't mind seeing him walking around. And I, but I don't want them eating up the crop before I get to eat. So, right. You know, that's a real hurting feeling when you put in all that work and then they come along and do that. But that's all part of knowing, though, that our Sea Island environment is healthy. Mm -hmm. I never right. want to reach a day when we don't see these animals that we grew up with. You know, we might, we might call them pests. But they call us pests, I'm sure. Right. You're right. We, because we actually we really digging up their that's their environment, yeah. their homes, and we're building on top of them and so exactly, yeah. exactly. So, you know, they try to be natural, we try to be natural, but right. we gotta live in balance and harmony. Yeah. And so it's a blessing to see them, just not when they eat up all the stuff we need to survive, because yeah. we gotta sustain ourselves on the farm. So what's your dad's um farm called? Freeman Farms. Freeman Farms, and see, that's why I love that name. John's Island. On John's Island, that's right. Yeah. I love Freeman Farms because that name is always about being free, but not free. just free men, but free women as well. Man. But he called us all freedmen after the Emancipation Proclamation was that's read right. up here in the Gullah Geechee Nation. So we have a lot of freedmen's, and so I love seeing Freeman Farms sign and knowing there's Freeman Farms on John's Island yet holding on holding from the land, holding from the culture. And read yeah. was that out that soil grow up hunter, naturally That's geeky. Right. And, and I like even that. named some of the product that from the one of the names, Freeman. Yes, yes, yes. That's for the brothers, right? That's for the brothers. Yes. Yeah, the Freeman is a, well, you know what? Because the products are natural, so the scent, you know, they're scented with essential oils. Yes. So, some women like that masculine smell. Oh, yeah, that scent. Yeah, they do. Yeah, so, but I made that for men. Yeah, and I'm going right. to bring out a, another men's scent, too, when I do, when I bring the other scents. I'll have two options for the men, at least three options, because I'll do the unscented for Brother Kwame as well. I know he yeah. loves unscented and yeah. blue, so I'm going to bring those back. Absolutely. And with the unscented, that works for a lot of people. Again, we go back to having allergies. Some yes. people are like, oh, yes. I don't want to, I don't want to chance it. So let mm -hmm. me just get the unscented one. Or mm -hmm. they just want to use the unscented when they just at home by themselves. But then you want the other sense when you're going out because you want to right. smelling all good and things like that. You know, mm -hmm. the scents mm -hmm. work with the senses and they ignite exactly. different things. Yeah, mm -hmm. different times. So it's good to get the whole line. So what are you going to do? You're going to do kind of a slow rollout till we get back to the whole 15? Yeah, we're going to do a, low, a slow rollout. You know, we got coronavirus going on around here. And, you know, um, shipments are coming in slow. You know, um, my products, you know, we source from Africa. And, 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 and it's hard with customs. And they having all kind of issues. So it's a slow roll. So we're going to slow roll everything out so we can make sure we have everything available to everybody and not be out of stock of stuff. So we're just going to slow roll it out. So right. everybody won't even know that I'm bringing these 15, only people that watch this. Subscribe, yeah, and well, who subscribe, who to, subscribe. Your, to your website so mm -hmm. they don't know. 
Yeah, they don't know when it, and they don't know exactly when it hits, when it drops. Everybody want to get a nice little email with a yeah. nice little promotional code to come in and try out these new scents. If you are new to the products and you only know about these five, then you can play around with the other ones. Excellent, and y'all have heard it. Slow roll it. Mm -hmm. I know y'all been thinking that. <laughs> yes, I know y'all been thinking that. So y'all can go on with the rest of the song. Y'all know the rest of the song. Y'all can. Sing we ain't gonna sing that song. We ain't gonna sing that part. We ain't gonna sing them for you. We ain't gonna sing that part. But mm -hmm. you know, the products might help you. The products. Might it might. Yeah. I'm sure it will. I, I, I am uh, absolutely positively sure that it's going to help. I've heard people say, people follow me in the store and say, what you got on? There you go. They do. It's true. It happens to me. People are like, wow, Queen, you smell so good. What's that? Naturally Geechee. What? And they just don't believe that it's lotion. They don't believe that all you got on is just lotion. Exactly. They don't. Like I told you, the lady thought I had on makeup. I'm like, <laughs> no, Naturally Geechee. This no makeup shea butter no makeup you know and so it's it's wonderful though to to make up this time to get a chance to to connect again you know yes. and you know i gotta give you an air hugs i know oh look at 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 get our three in there because we was getting it in before yeah Roman man we was moving man yeah, but you know that what we gotta. I, I'm taking this this coronavirus as a um as a sign for for you to slow down and, and really stop and get things in order. Cause so when the world comes back together, I feel like no one should have any excuses. Cause we had a lot of downtime. Yes. So yes. you should have pulled your affairs in order and get your mind right, get your body right, get your spirit right. Because you don't have nothing but a bunch of downtime. Downtime. So when the world comes back, we should be ready to hit the ground running. Ready to roll, ready to roll. Mm -hmm. And I actually like that faux pas because you said a bunch of dime time. And I like that, you know, <laughs> you, know you want to be a dime, we telling you get online, go ahead to naturallygeechee.com, get your products and make sure to subscribe so you know when we slow roll it and those different flavors come on back out once again yeah. get the whole line of products and like we said if you need to special order you can get that couture custom made one just for you but tanky tanky we so bless up because of you Olubusala. you are truly a blessing to the Gullah Geechee nation I do pray yeah. I want you to just give any final words to the community because you know y'all gotta be ready now she gonna be right there July 25th noon for hashtag Gullah Geechee 2020 virtually, if you go to Eventbrite right now and find the link for Take a Stand for Gullah Geechee Land, hashtag Gullah Geechee 2020 virtually, you can go ahead and register now. The tickets are free, but that way you'll have everything to link up on that day and all the updates and things will come straight to you. Or you can email us to G-U-L-L-G-E-E-C-O at aol.com gogeco at aol.com that's the Gullah Geechee Sea Island Coalition's website they sponsor this broadcast along with the Gullah Geechee Sustainability Think Tank our members they are at the University of Minnesota Create Fellowship we want to thank y'all definitely our sister Kylie who's on the board today and so before we go away Olubusala give any last words to the family about what it up being naturally Geechee First, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you very much for bringing me on and giving me the opportunity to share a little bit about me and my story and my products. I want everybody to know, don't forget, go to www.naturallygeechee.com and subscribe to the website so you can get all the updates and little gifts or um, promotions and everything that, so you'll be aware of everything that we're doing. Um, I just want everybody to remember to take care of your body Take care of your skin is the longest, largest organ on our bodies and to take care of your health, man. Like we gotta, um, we have to do better. We got, we have coronavirus going on and hearing a lot of people dying from underlying conditions and stuff like that. And you have to take care of your bodies when you're young, you know what I mean? And so when you can have a healthy older life, you know what I'm saying? It's not taking too much off of you to go and eat some extra fruits and veggies. If you guys can do that for me, you know, get your healthy servings of fruits and vegetables every single day so you can help sustain your body and then use natural products like mine or just use mine right. on your skin right. well, and on your hair <laughs> right. to preserve who you are naturally. Absolutely. And that's how it is being naturally Geechee. 
So we are so happy for you. You are a blessing to us. And y'all can follow Gullah Geechee Nation.com, Gullah Geechee Nation.com, as well as the Gullah Geechee Nation Facebook fan page. You'll be able to see this video again. You'll be able to share it with your friends. Subscribe to Gullah Geechee.tv on YouTube. And you'll also know and get alerts not only about our celebration that's coming up with the telethon, but when there are other promotions, other releases, we'll have Ola Busala back on the program so that we can talk about those new things that are coming out. But in the meantime, get ready for that slow roll of the Yes, that's returning. And so that you have that because this summer, believe me, you will love being naturally Geechee. And we be Gullah Geechee anointed people. I'm Queen Quet, head from the body of the Gullah Geechee Nation. I just want to show y'all something that's also going to be available at the telethon. Look at that. I got mm -hmm. mine. I should have worn mine today. Yes, I said, watch her come on here with the shirt on. And I, I saw thought about it. Shirt. Yes, and I said, we're going to be dressed alike. I said, watch her come on here. I said, y'all know I don't normally wear tea, but I had to wear this one today. This is our saltwater daughter tea with the artwork by the one and only Quadre Stucky. He will also be part of that hashtag Gullah Geechee 2020 virtually telethon. So we're going to have products that are going to be shown on the Gullah Geechee Nation Facebook fan page and at Gullah Geechee on Twitter, at Gullah Geechee on Instagram. Y'all have seen us feature Naturally Geechee already. We're going to be rolling out more and more of our products and things and the websites where you can purchase these items and get geared up because Gullah Geechee Nation Appreciation Week is July 25th to August the 1st. So you can start now. Go to Gullah Geechee.biz. Gullah Geechee.biz. And one more time, G-U-L-L-A-H-G-E-E-C-H-E-E. -E -E -E. And no I and Geechee for the week. Gullah Geechee. So at Gullah Geechee on Twitter, at Gullah Geechee on Instagram, Gullah Geechee Nation.com. Gullah Geechee Nation Facebook fan page, Gullah Geechee TV, Gullah Geechee TV, and also follow at Naturally Geechee on all of those and Snapchat, and you'll be able to connect with the products we talked about today, but also you'll learn more about Brother Quadre Stuckey, how you can get your saltwater daughter tea, and we have something for the Sea Island Suns too, so y'all can rub on that free man. And then mm -hmm. put that shirt on and be all geared up for Gullah Geechee Nation Appreciation Week 2020. We taking a stand for Gullah Geechee land. That's right. But in order to stand strong, we got to be healthy and we got to be alive. So, you know, our ancestors are with us, but they ain't telling us to come rushing over there on that side yet. It's time for those who are still here to still stand up and fight for what's right. And you got to start by fighting for your health and fighting to make sure that you are healthy. Thank God we be naturally Geechee. And I'm so glad for Fidelia with all of her children. One more again, and she had a queen quit, head from the body of the Gullah Geechee Nation, wishing you peace, love, blessings, and good health. See you again next week on Zooming In on Sustainability. Peace and blessings, everybody.